busy Sunday mornings hiding under covers. I don't mind staying in with you. Play your favorite movie, laying right beside me. I don't mind when it's just us two. The corner coffee shop we like to go. Late night walks with you to take me home. With you, I never feel alone. These little songs make me glad to call you mine. And you have got my head. Welcome so much to another video. My name is Don Cassie. Those of us who are new here, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I'm a mom of two, and I'm also a wife. And I also have a job that allows me allows me to work from home. So this day was one of the days that I was going to work. We had something that really needed my attention at work. It's actually an emergency, and I had to go. Yeah, I'm on the road. First off was at our circle i had some few questions that i wanted to ask so i had to pass by so finally at the circle and i sat on those chairs just to wait for my turn so that i could be attended then i'll proceed to work <laughs> Walking to the market, strolling hand in hand Exchanging letters when you're away Don't need any effort when we are together We always have fun throughout the day I do anything to get your attention When you say you love me I seem to ascend to the heavens above Where we fall in love I don't know what I would do without you Because all I need All I need Is you Make me fly To the clouds One, two, three All that I need Is your body next to me On rainy days Just need your company Throw me too much so welcome and i know this segment will be a bit different because this is not what you are used to but i'm finally at my workplace and i want to say that this is what was bringing me here i'll be explaining some bits here and there yeah so my people we work i work in a water company and i've been here for the past for the last five years this is my sixth year uh on in this company it has been good but this this season the pump that is underground is the one that had broke or spoiled it couldn't pump water you know when you're using a pump to pump water from the underground to the overhead tank there is a pump that is called a submissible pump so this is this submissible pump was the one that had broken down and that means that there was no water that was being supplied to our customers or or anything like that so the technicians are on site already so they are repairing they are they are trying to remove the that broken pump from the underground and i'm telling you it is underground karibu this is 300 meters deep 300 meters deep so um, it is a bit of work. It took us like four days to fix this and that's why part of my last week was me just going to work ensuring that the, the technicians have whatever they need and of course you can't just let people uh, do the work without you being there. So of course I had to be there to ensure everything is running well and smoothly. Yeah, so we'll be seeing these clips here and here and there. Um, and I hope you enjoy and get to learn something new. Lazy Sunday mornings hiding. Yeah, so sorry guys, I forgot to put my phone in uh, in a landscape mode. But this is the pump that is uh, from the underground. And this is what pumps water from the underground to the overhead tank. 
yeah so this means that when this pump is it working it means that um there's no water that is coming from the ground and hence all the reservoirs are dry and uh, that means no one is having water or there's no water that is being supplied so this is the pump sorry guys sorry sorry i forgot to put the phone on a landscape mode the clouds on the one two three all that i need is your body next to me on rainy days just need your company don't need too much just your simple love and it's everything the simple joy of hearing your voice every morning i wake to a kiss on my face so i so these cables you are seeing here they are called sensors or they are called electric cables so they go hand in hand with the pipe so when the pipe is being lowered uh, the cable is also tied around and being lowered together with the pipe yeah so you'll be seeing this in the next clip <laughs> Walking to the market, strolling hand in hand, exchange. So now the pipes that are being lowered on the ground, it is not one huge pipe. These pipes are six meters long, so they have to be to be a uh, kufunganishwa here and there, so that when they lower one pipe, they come again, they tie it again together, and then they lower that one. So you'll see them now; they are joining the pipe. So here they'll just join these two pipes. And then they'll use the clean to lower the the pipes. And then on that side, you can see the cables, uh, the sensor cables. So they'll be tied along the pipe. They'll be clipped together. And then they'll be lowered, lowered on the ground. So uh, this is what the technicians are doing. I hope you guys are following along and learning and getting to learn something new. I know it may not be everyone's favorite, but I hope someone will get something. The seasons come and go like thoughts of you. The technicians must ensure that these uh, these pipes have been uh, have been uh, tied properly, because if it doesn't, it will bring other problems, which is a very tedious tedious process. Yeah, so that's why you are seeing the technicians tying and ensuring that the pipes are firm and they are ready to go to go to the ground. So the the pipe is now being lowered lowered underground, and they are also clipping the sensor and the electric uh, electric cables. So they go hand in hand. So the process uh, goes a bit slowly. And they have 45 of these pipes to put underground. If I tell you we were here for four days, you can now believe me. It was a bit tedious. But um, yeah, this one had to be done. So those are the pipes are, that are going uh, underground. The seasons turn and change just like your mind. Like the sun gives in to the moon into the night Time continues marching, it slowly crawls With each new Yeah, so the technicians will repeat the same process They tie one pipe to another And then side by side we have the cable And then we have the sensor and then they will lower to the ground so they repeat this process until all the 45 pipes are underground and then thereafter they will ensure that the water is pumping then they can leave I hope you got something uh, that you have taken home 
uh, I hope I've just empowered someone in some of the things that happened when repairing a submissible borehole pump and this is the process so at this point I think uh, we, uh, I just went home and I got to do some things which I'll be sharing with you here all right hi 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 how are you doing my people i want to make some tea scones and these tea scones they are very easy um this one is the easiest easiest way that you can prepare your tea scones so i want to make some tea scones but before we start i want to show you what you require yeah for this one you are going to need some sugar these are simple tea scones so you need some sugar i have measured my ingredients already just to make my work easier here so I have some sugar. I hope you guys can see. I have some sugar. And then I have some flour. This flour is the self-raising flour. But if you are not using the self-raising flour, you are going to need some baking powder. But for me, I have, I'm using the self-raising flour. So I don't see the need of baking powder. So you have some flour here. And then you have some margarine. You can use margarine or you can use butter, whichever you have. But for me, this is margarine. Or even you can use the blue band if you, um, if you don't have any of those. You can still use blue band and the result will be still fantastic. So I have some um, margarine. And then I will be adding a pinch of salt. And then I have some milk here. This is the only ingredient, ingredient that you require to make the... This comes and I promise you they will be so yummy. The method is so simple, so let's get into it. First method that, uh, or the first step that we do here, it is to mix our sugar and our flour. It, it is flour or flour, depending, depending on how your teacher taught you to pronounce it. Yeah, so, so I'll mix this. Even then, um, I'll then add in the salt. For the salt, I'm just going to use half a tablespoon of salt. Yeah, for the salt, I'll keep it really easy. So I'll give this a mix. A, a mix. You can use a whisk at this stage. So there you go. And then at this point is where I'll add in the the margarine remember i said if you don't have margarine you can use the blue band yeah so i'm just going to add in the margarine so after this we are going to use the rub method and mix our ingredients together so i'm just going to go in with my hands and my hands are clean so we rub this um this margarine and the flour together until they become like uh what are they called breadcrumbs so we we'll mix everything here until we form something like breadcrumbs. Yeah. And by the way, if you prefer to use water, you can go ahead and use water. Uh, if you don't take milk, there are others who add in um, eggs. I promise you, the recipes are quite a number, so you just choose what you what works for you and what you feel like it's uh, nice for you so i'll just mix this one of the ways to know to know that your flour is ready for the next step or your flour is ready for the next step that the color of your flour will turn to something like pale yellow yeah so already it is starting to form the pale yellow color so i'll continue to mix just to be sure that everything is well well mixed yeah this is a workout process your muscles will be working out at this stage yeah so uh, this is it this is done so the next process is to add in our milk so i'm just going to add it gradually and then i'll um, i'll now make my dough
We are going to mix this until we form a dough. The seasons come and go like thoughts of you Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue and They change but in a cycle that I can't lose Each painful but delightful to live through Just like another season Not for long, just a time Just like another season Maybe this time next year Now at this stage guys, I now transfer my my, my, flour, uh, my dough to the working surface So that I need it for around 5 more minutes And then we proceed to the next step <laughs> And uh, it's ready for the next step. The next step is quite simple as well. Yeah, we we'll just be spreading the dough and cutting it using a tumbler just to get our shapes. Yeah, should be soft. And when you press it like this, should be bouncing back to you. That one, uh, telling you that the dough is ready. So you just press it, press it like this. The dough should bounce back to you. Yeah, one more time. Press the dough. And then, when you see it bouncing back to you, just know that the dough is ready. And at this point, it is. Yeah, so I first prepared the baking tin uh, or the baking tray. And then I just put some oil, spread it using a brush. And at this point, you can use a parchment paper. Uh, but for me, I didn't have one. So I just go for the easy, easy way of doing this. Yeah, so that's why I spread oil and I just uh, brush it out with a brush and my pan is ready. So at this point also, my pan is preheating. My oven is preheating at 180 degrees for 10 minutes and then uh, it will be ready to bake our tea scones. Each time of year carries memories like a never fading whisper in the breeze Oh, we will keep on changing So, I'm ready to spread the dough and I'm already doing that already And I won't be spreading it too much Because, you know, we are making tea scones And if you spread it, if you spread the dough too much you'll get, You end up having a very hard tea scones And they won't be the what you are looking for so at this point, I just left it maybe half an inch thin and then I will just spread it and use my my glass cup to cut the shapes because I don't have the donut cutters and the like. So I just use my cup to get the shape and then after this, we'll just place them in our baking tray and then they'll go to the oven. They'll be baking for around 30 minutes. Yeah. Lazy Sunday mornings hiding under covers. I don't mind staying in with you. Play your favorite movie, laying right beside me I don't mind when it's just us two The corner coffee shop we like to go Late night walks with you to take me home With you I never feel alone These little songs so we, we repeat the same process and uh, we'll do the same to what we did to the first batch. We just spread the dough, 
um, get the shapes and then place them on the baking tray so this is the second round i'll do this until i get all my shapes and then um i will not have any dough that is remaining Joy of hearing your voice every morning I wake to a kiss on my face So oh, I don't need too much Just your simple love and it's together we always have fun throughout the day i do anything to get your attention when you say you love me i seem to ascend to the heavens above where we fall yeah so my people my my tea scones are ready and uh i want to say that this one did take i had mentioned 20 minutes 35 25 minutes but I really underrated this because it took me around 40 minutes to cook this. Uh, but I'm glad that uh, they are all done. But I also noted that at some point, uh, my children also regulated the temperature and it went a little low because I had set it at 180 degrees, but they, they regulated it to 120. So it took a bit longer to cook. But all in all, this is the end product. So our scones are ready, they are so yummy. Yeah, so they are crunchy on the outside and super, super soft on the inside. And I love them this way. We already started feasting on them. Yeah, so really done on the inside and super, super crunchy on the outside. So as I mentioned earlier, this is a quick fix. Um, and I bet you have everything in your pantry because you saw the ingredients were really minimal and simple. Yeah, so this is it. This is how our tea scones came out. Uh, comment down below how you cook your tea scones or how you prepare your tea scones. Did you love my method? And if you did, please leave a comment below and let me know. Lazy Sunday mornings hiding under covers. I don't mind staying in with you. Play your favorite movie, laying right beside me. I don't mind when it's just us two. The corner coffee shop we like to go. Late night walks with you to take me home. With you, I never feel alone. These little songs make me glad to call you mine And you have got my head in the clouds One, two, three All that I need is your body next to me On rainy days, just need your company Don't need too much, just your simple love and it's so this was another evening from work and uh, there were some clothes which were lying on the clothesline for around three days so i just unhung them and then i started folding them because i knew if i just let them lie on the seat they may end up sitting there for even a week or so so i just gathered my strength here and folded the clothes and then um i'll just return them to that karai and then i'll take them to their respective respective uh places of uh placing them here yeah. away don't need any effort when we are together we always have fun throughout the day i do anything to get your attention when you say 
So I'm taking this opportunity to thank my premier gang. Thank you, thank you all for always coming here to chat with him when to chat with me whenever I upload a video. And thank you so much to the new subscribers. I really appreciate that that one subscriber who really find my channel worthy of his or her subscription. I'm really, really grateful. So if you haven't subscribed, this is your chance to do so. Kindly subscribe, hit the red button. Although nowadays it's a black button, but just hit the black button, subscribe, and enjoy more of my content. So um, thank you so much for watching this video to the end. I just uh, thank you for being here. Uh, if you haven't given this video a like, please do so. If you haven't subscribed, kindly do so. Uh, leave a comment and those of us who can share, please do. I will highly, highly appreciate. So, yeah. Can't imagine living life if we were to go. So, until my next upload, until my next video, bye! We go, don't you know that all that I need is your body next to me on rainy days? Just need your company, don't need too much, just your simple love and